Good day and God bless you fam. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful week. The word of the Lord reminded me from Exodus chapter 34. A promise that God gave to Moses when he visited him. So God visited Moses and from verse uh, 6, this is what he says. Then the Lord passed in front of Moses and called out, I am the Lord God. I am merciful and I am very patient with my people. I show great love and I can be trusted. I show great love and I can be trusted. That's what says the Lord. And then from verse 7 he says, I keep my promises to my people forever. But I also punish anyone who sins. But I also punish anyone who sins. You know, our relationship with God is not a one-track relationship. God expects us to put in our effort, or like we say in business, you've got to have skin in the game. He says, I punish sin. But for you, this is what I'm going to do for you. Number one, he says, I can be trusted. I can be trusted. And then he says, I am patient with my people. I am patient with my people. Put your name there. I am patient with Dawn, says the Lord. And then the third thing he says is that I keep my promises. I keep my promises. You see, God is giving us an assurance here. But at the very end, he says, I also punish those who sin. Guys, we've got to come to a place where we don't look at God as the God who only gives us the things that we want him to give us. He's saying, shun sin, put sin behind you. And these are the benefits that come with my relationship with you. You know, we often have been, as human beings, we come to a place where we only look up to God when we are in trouble or when we need something. But he's saying, no, I'm more after a relationship with you. So today, my prayer for you is this, that you cultivate a relationship, a deep relationship, not a relationship that is just after the benefits, but a relationship that is true. You know, you and I know the relationships that we are in. You know the relationship that is only there because of what they can get from you. Well, how much more do you think God knows that our relationship with Him is based not because of who He is or what He is, but basically because of what He can give us? The Lord God knows everything, including the intent of man's heart. If you and I know the relationships that we have around us, how much more does God know the intent of your heart? Seek Him first. Seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness. Then all these other things shall be added unto you. God bless you and keep you. Have a wonderful week in Jesus' name.